can remember seeing very early on, I was only about five or six, watching somebody lathe materials and being fascinated by the interference colours on them, but also seeing materials like metals behave in unusual ways. I'd always liked science and mathematics, but chemistry didn't really um, sort of emerge as my passion until quite late. In fact, early on, I thought it was perhaps a little boring. One of the delightful things about it is how it applies to so many um, of, the, of the areas in today's world, from understanding about healthcare and life sciences, through environment, through to the more engineering. It's a very, very underpinning, very powerful, sometimes quite a hidden subject. And for me, science has to be, you know, it's about discovery, but it's also about having that personal insight and then getting to the edge, doing some of the exciting things, learning about some of the new, um, some of the research was completely fascinating. I've had a very varied career. I suppose the, the heart of it is on growing science-based businesses. I started off as an academic, but I've moved into business and I've worked in both the public and the private sector but always growing interesting ideas um, into business propositions. And now I find myself working in the public sector, um, looking at how we can encourage more high-tech businesses to grow, and also having an input into policy and seeing how the UK can really develop its role as a highly innovative nation. What I find really interesting is balancing the innovation and the new science with making sure that it actually addresses the real need, a real social need, and so is, is, is going to solve a problem. One of the things that I like about chemistry, or I think is valuable about chemistry, is actually how, how wide the applications are and how relevant they are to many of the big challenges which drive business today. If you look at the high-tech in businesses of tomorrow, they're often solving some of the big challenges climate change, low carbon economy, new transport, healthcare, helping the aged. The range of opportunities for chemists and chemistry to play a really major role in the exciting businesses of tomorrow is just limitless. And so it's often the combination of different sciences and looking at how users, customers, you and I, are going to take up new applications that provides the challenge. And it's really quite interesting bringing together different groups of people to address these challenges. Mm -hmm.